everybody, this is George with Melnix Automotive. In this video, I would like to share with you how to find out which pulley is making the humming noise. We are working on a 2013 Ford Escape, and uh, when we start the engine, we do have a noise, and we're not sure if it's coming from alternator, is it idler pulley, is it tensioner, um, or AC compressor. The easiest way to find out is, um, I personally like to use uh, a long, like a flat tip screwdriver. You want to be careful. You don't want to get it between the belt when the engine is running. And what I do, I usually put it on the alternator and I listen and I could usually hear what kind of noise it makes. Uh, same with all the idler pulleys and the AC compressor. So uh, you don't want to go ahead and replace an uh, AC compressor if it's an alternator. So this is the easiest way to tell and uh, let's get going. So we're going to start the engine and go from there. All right, so we got the engine going. As you guys can hear, I'm not sure if the microphone can pick it up, but I do have a little bit of a weird noise coming from one of the pulleys, um, and we're not sure. So this is the way I usually test the water pump, and you can clearly hear that sound. There you go, it's obviously not normal. So what I usually do, you want to be careful, you don't want to get this inside your pulley because you could damage a lot um, in your engine. I usually go ahead and I put it on top of the water pump and then I put my ear right on the screwdriver and I can hear exactly what's happening inside of my pulley. So the idler and the water pump are running pretty smooth. Now I'm going to go ahead and put it on top of the alternator and listen. That's it. It's my alternator. So this is the easiest way to figure out without replacing all the pulleys, because uh, it could get quite expensive. In my next video, I'll show you how we pull it out and we replace it. Dealer quoted us over $1,000 to replace this alternator. I'll show you how you can get this job done for under $300.